Welcome to the Orion Vibes. Today, let's understand little known facts about home plants, the placement of clocks, mirrors, and water bodies according to Vastu Shastra, the ancient Indian science of architecture. We'll unveil the names of these plants, where to place them in your home, and the benefits they bring. Tulsi, the northeast corner of the house or the puja room. Known for its spiritual significance, Tulsi purifies the atmosphere, wards off negative energies, and promotes mental peace. Money plant place in the southeast corner of the house, preferably near the entrance. As per Vastu, the money plant attracts wealth and prosperity while also purifying the air and balancing humidity levels. Aloe Vera Best place near windows or balconies in the south or west direction. According to Vastu, Aloe Vera brings health, prosperity and protection from negative energies. Its medicinal properties also promote physical well-being. Snake plant Recommended for bedrooms, living rooms, or study rooms, especially in corners. Known as a symbol of good luck, the snake plant absorbs toxins, purifies the air, and enhances concentration and productivity. Jasmine is ideal for balconies or windows facing north or east. Jasmine not only adds fragrance and beauty but also brings positivity and harmony and strengthens relationships within the household. Neem tree Ideally planted in the northeast direction or backyard. Revered for its medicinal properties, the neem tree purifies the air, repels insects, and promotes overall well-being, both physically and spiritually. Spider plant is perfect for bathrooms or kitchens, especially in areas with indirect sunlight. These plants are believed to neutralize negative energy, improve air quality, and enhance vitality and creativity. Lavender Place in bedrooms or living rooms near windows for sunlight. Lavender promotes relaxation, peaceful sleep, and mental clarity. Its fragrance also wards off insects and promotes emotional well-being. Basil Ideal for kitchen windowsills or balconies receiving sunlight. Basil attracts positive energy, enhances the taste in food, and offers medicinal benefits like stress relief and improved digestion. According to Vastu Shastra, some plants are believed to bring negative energy or disrupt the balance within the home environment. Here are a few plants that are generally not recommended to be kept indoors according to Vastu principles. Cactus is associated with sharp energy and may create discord or tension within the household. While bonsai trees are admired for their beauty, but they are believed to stop the growth and can symbolize stagnation or restricted progress according to Vastu. Milkweed is considered inauspicious and may attract negative vibrations into the home. Plants with thorns, such as roses with sharp thorns, are typically avoided indoors, as they can disrupt the flow of positive energy and may cause accidents or conflicts. Dead plants. Keeping dead or dried plants in the house is considered inauspicious as they represent stagnation and lack of vitality. It's essential to remove them promptly and replace them with healthy, vibrant plants. Hope you're enjoying this video. Please press subscribe to The Orion Vibes and like our videos. Few more special tips for arranging clocks, mirrors, and water bodies. Let's check. The placement of a wall clock plays a significant role in Vastu Shastra, the ancient Indian science of architecture. Here are some tips for placing wall clocks. The best place to hang a wall clock is on the north wall of a room. This direction is believed to attract positive energy and prosperity into the home. Avoid placing above doors. It's advised not to hang wall clocks above any doors, regardless of direction. This placement is believed to obstruct the growth and progress of the person occupying the home. Avoid cluttered spaces. Avoid placing the wall clock in cluttered or congested areas of the room. A clean and unobstructed space around the clock promotes clarity of thought and enhances the flow of positive energy. The placement of mirrors in the home is significant for maintaining positive energy flow. Mirrors can be placed on the west wall of a room. This direction is associated with creativity, prosperity and social connections. A mirror here is believed to enhance these aspects of life. Mirrors can also be placed on the south wall. This direction is associated with fame, recognition and career advancement. Placing a mirror here is believed to amplify these positive energies. Finally, it's essential to consider the size, shape and placement to ensure they reflect light and energy positively throughout the space. Additionally, avoid placing mirrors directly opposite the entrance or facing the bed as this may disrupt the flow of energy. 
Remember to like the video and subscribe to The Orien Vibes. Like our videos and share the knowledge to transform your home into a sanctuary of positive energies. Placing a water body such as a water fountain, aquarium or water feature in the northeast corner of the home is considered auspicious. The northeast corner is associated with positive energy and prosperity. Here's why water bodies are typically placed in this location. Water symbolizes wealth, abundance and purity in Vastu Shastra. Placing a water body in the northeast corner is believed to attract positive energy related to prosperity and well-being into the home. The northeast corner is known as the Ishan, a sacred corner in Vastu Shastra. It is associated with the element of water and is considered highly auspicious for placing water features. Water has a natural flow and placing it in the northeast corner helps to maintain a harmonious flow of energy throughout the home. It enhances the positive vibrations and promotes a sense of tranquility and balance. Finally, placing a water body in the northeast corner helps to balance the elemental energies and create a harmonious living environment. Hope you liked the video. Please press the bell icon to subscribe to The Orient Vibes, like our videos and share the knowledge to transform your home into a sanctuary of positive energies. Thank you and see you in the next video.